Some uh, students of mine have been asking me about some of the licks that they see me do, um, and I figured I'd go ahead and, and make a short video about some of those licks and, and how I um, put them together. Uh, the first of which is a regular triplet. Now, most of us know a triplet um, with the bass drum, you know, being right, left foot, right, left foot. Um, one of the variations I've done on that is to switch the hands back and forth, though, to go right, left foot, left, right foot, right, left foot, left, right foot. Um, this makes for some nice colors that you would otherwise not be able to get. Um, so that's kind of cool and you can uh, do some variations of that uh, around the kit, maybe at the end of a fill you want to come back in on the right hand or you want to come back on the left hand well that's a way that you can utilize uh, that particular lick and make it so that so you can end on the right hand or end on the left hand like that um, another lick that a lot of people ask me about is the paradiddle diddle um, most of us know the paradiddle diddle, right, left, right, right, left, left. So what if I squeeze the foot in between those first two single strokes? Pretty cool. Now, to go on from there, I can do some variations of that. I can do a para para diddle diddle. And what I can do now is put the foot in between both groups of single strokes. So it would be. Um See, a little bit slower. Actually, I think that, that one there I was going around the kid is actually a para 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 diddle diddle para 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 diddle diddle. Let's see. Uh... So I hope that gives you some uh, stuff to go home and practice and, and take a look at.